Hey everyone, this is um, called Tinker Herc and uh, here we have uh, a final result of the MIDI keyboard. As you see, it's connected to the QY, QY100 Yamaha module and uh, you can play something. So it's a polyphonic uh, non-velocity sensitive keyboard. Um, yeah, it's pretty much portable. If you what you have is uh, the keyboard and the sound module, which you pretty much can take anywhere you want and play on the go. And you can basically plug it to anything you want, which is MIDI enabled. So, for example, here I have um, a zero uh, MIDI to USB converter which is plugged in my CPU so you can plug it to and here we have just a simple stop to test the keyboard so as you can see I'm pressing the um, pressing the keys and we have a polyphonic sound coming out okay let's Open it up and see what we have inside. Uh, here I'm opening the top lid, and as you can see, that this is all we need. All we need to have this uh, keyboard working, which is a uh, uh, very simple setup. We have um, original PCB from from the cache uh, the keyboard, which is very simple. It's um, just a bunch of buttons, pretty much, that uh, are reacting on pressing and releasing, and it just send sends uh, uh, send, send those events via this um, 8 by uh, 8 plus 4 8 columns 4 rows cable to the microcontroller so what we did we, we, we basically took this existing part uh, and plug it to our new microcontroller which is um, Arduino uh, enabled Arduino based device plus a uh, simple shield which is sitting on top of the Arduino implementing the um, Parallel shift out schematics. Um, all these schematics, once again, all these all these schematics are available on the website called tinkerhack.com, and uh, you have everything to build this project. All you need is uh, either new or preferably dead toy, so you don't spend too much money, uh, and you can experiment building a MIDI keyboard. So as you can see, there is still plenty of room inside the keyboard. You can. Put lots of other things. For example, here, you know, you could put a speaker and uh, amplifier module. Uh, here, you could put something else. You know, some some other projects can fit inside uh, wonderfully. And in the middle, we have this uh, container to to plug the sound modules. And it's it can be anything. This game, it can be anything, any mid enable sound module. Um, so it's a polyphonic MIDI keyboard.